Talal Alswalmi from Jordan, the match commissioner, and the referee uh, Taimur Fazulin, who started this tournament a week ago, a goalless draw between Pakistan and Bangladesh. He's now been given the honor of conducting the first semi final. There they start, India playing from right to left. Long clearance. There will be delayed flights now, but football's continuing. And a chance for India, Clifford Miranda, and this could have been the first goal. Shaky start by Maldives, but India have missed a sitter. It's JJ Lal Peklua, really the youngster, probably butterflies in the stomach. Savio knows he should have put that away. Now Sayyid Rahim Nabi taking on Mohamed Umair, Maldives best defender. Gets the cross in and a lovely header by JJ Lal Peklua. Trying to make amends for that sitter missed. Goalkeeper Imran Mohammed of the BB Sports Club with a wonderful save. He's taking on the responsibility now, Clifford. And that's the first goal. Mistake in the Maldives defence. And it is JJ finally, maybe more by accident than design, we'll have a look, or is it Nabi? We'll have a look. So Clifford taking the free kick, the penetrated free kick, yes it is Sayyid Rahim Nabi, the congratulations he's receiving. Have a look again, Clifford's hanging free kick, JJ goes for the header. And yes, Nabi connects it first time and with his non-favourite foot, the right foot. So that's it. India 1-0 ahead. Nabi sneaking into a scoring position. And happy days are here again for Indian football. As Sayyid Rahim Nabi, the Mohun Bagan midfielder and now sheer joy on Savio Madeira's face and the Indian bench. And a chance here for Maldives. Side netting, otherwise this could have been trouble. Is Karanjit hurt? This is why Ishfa, he pounces like a tiger. He's got the eye of a tiger. Sudden acceleration. It's the Maldives fans who are cheering away. As they are attacking relentlessly. And this could be a good chance and a great save by Karanjit. He receives the applause of his teammates. Remarkable save by Karanji. Good through ball to Akram Abdul Ghani, who's been a menace on the left, lays it back well. A first time shot and into the roof of the net. What an equalizer. Akram Abdul Ghani setting it up. And Maldives back in the match. Sheer jubilation for their supporters. That's Akram Abdul Ghani perfectly lays it back and it went with the speed of a rifle bullet. What a brilliant shot. And that was Shamwil Kasim. Nice ball here, a chance here. Is he been brought down? Is this a penalty? Yes, it's a penalty and the referee is going to show a card. Yellow card to number 13. That is Asad Abdul Ghani, the 35-year-old veteran. He's brought Chetri down. That was a lovely penetrative diagonal ball. Golden chance for India to go 2-1 ahead. He scored in July, 10th July 2011 in a friendly match, Sunil Chetri scored against in the one-all draw. A chance for him to make it 2-1 for India and one foot in the final.
can he get this penalty against the 30 year old Imran up steps Sunil Chetri and scores with a lovely placement calm cool as a cucumber Sunil Chetri has put India ahead in the 69th minute penalty was given when he was tripped and he continues his remarkable record of scoring in every round of this tournament five goals now in this tournament only I am Vijayan with six goals in has scored more in 1997 I am Vijayan there we see it goalkeeper went the wrong way and he calmly places it in Bomadumair taking the free kick they've got height in defence but Maldives also have got some tall players India managed to recover JJ and Sunil Chetri Sunil Chetri on his own can he wrap up the match and yes he does and it's India all the way nothing can stop India now as Sunil Chetri scores his second goal of the match and they know they are in the final Pradeep Datta, Savio, Marcus Pacheco and the team officials lovely breakaway move by India fine passing Umair left stranded Chetri looks up sees the goalkeeper advance places it to his right that's the perfect ball by JJ Lal Peklua and Sunil Chetri makes no mistake So he's equal Vijayan's record of six goals in a tournament. It's a chance for him now to go ahead of the legendary I am Vijayan. That's it, Sushil Kumar Singh. He was the captain in 2009 when India won the tournament. He's getting a feel here of the ball. And India has entered the final again. Beating arch rivals Maldives 3-1. And it's Sunil Chetri all the way. Credit to Savio Madeira and his team and we can safely say Savio Madeira has come of age as a coach. All the time he's been in the limelight, in, in, he's been in the sidelines. Assistant to Bob Houghton, assistant to Armando Colasso. This is Savio Madeira's team and he's done it in style. Kept faith with certain players like Rokas Lamare and Anthony Pereira of whom there was criticism that why were they playing. But he's, India played excellent football today, scintillating football except for a brief patch and exchanged handshakes and so the final score in the first semi-final it's not as comfortable as the score line looks because India was made to struggle for a long period of the second half but the final score with two goals by J3, India 3, Maldives 1